common interests through keyword partnerships. That's what is taking place in this room. It is partnerships. It is the power of our example of where it is the empowerment of the people. So as we leave Copenhagen today, we want to thank you for taking the time. We want to thank you for participating in what we consider to be a grand, groundbreaking <coughs> event and to sharing your valuable insights. You, all of us, are very, very proud. We believe we have accomplished a great deal over these last few days. We believe that you all have had great, frank, and fruitful discussions. And so we implore the challenge, and we understand the challenges facing minority leaders in the United States and Europe. But at the same time, we have and shared best practices to overcome these challenges. So when you return to your communities, we encourage you to continue to build a network, to continue to communicate with each other, and to support the development and the ongoing commitment to build a new generation of young leaders who are dedicated to creating a more open and representative institutions. Simply put, we call upon all of you to become the transatlantic inclusion leaders of your respected generation, to go forward with mutual respect and mutual interests and without limits on what is possible. And to understand, at the end of the day, not only is it about partnerships that we have had and developed in this room, it really is about the collaboration. Because it is the effort that we believe that takes place between peers that happens at this level between state and local officials and those organizations that serve them will continue to strengthen our bilateral relationships with all of your countries. And we really appreciate being with you and we thank you very much.